Hello, you're watching Much Ado About Something, and I'm Donna. Tonight we're going to be cutting up green bell peppers. I, I cut these up and freeze them for recipes uh, later in the week or even the month. But I wanted to just show you a budget-friendly, economical, easy way to cut these without wasting a whole lot of your pepper. Let me put you up here. I've already washed these peppers and let them dry so that we would uh, be able to cut them up and go ahead and freeze them. Now, when you get your pepper, you'll have to look it over for imperfections. We try not to buy them with imperfections, but sometimes when you get them, you'll find a little nick here or there. And of course, that doesn't hurt the pepper at all. And you just go down and cut around the inside of the pepper. It takes a few minutes to do this, but you're not throwing away a lot of your pepper when you do it this way. You can see all the insides, and I just take the knife and run it around the edge and get out all of the the white pith and the seeds. And I do that to both sides of the pepper. Just cut out the save your uh, your waste for your chickens or for your compost bin. And after I've done that, I just take a chopping knife and just cut little strips. Now sometimes I freeze the little strips if I'm going to make use them for stir fry. A recipe where a whole pepper is needed, then I'll just go right ahead and freeze these or uh, use these like this. But most of the time, I just go ahead and give them my final chop and use chopped peppers, and that's what I freeze and put in the freezer to use as, as needed. And you can chop them as fine or as big as you need them for your recipes. I use these on pizzas, use them in chili beans, spaghetti sauce, meatloaf, so many dishes. These are pretty chopped up pretty big, so you can always run your knife over them and chop them up as fine as you want them. And you can see here, that's the inside, that's the waste off of one bell pepper. So you don't have a whole lot of waste. Not a lot of green in there, it's just the seeds and the, and the stem part and the pith. All of your pepper is right here to be used. You didn't waste a lot of it. Get out your freezer bag, label your bell peppers, we don't have to put green on there because we can see it's not going to change color in the freezer so we don't know. I use them so often that I usually don't put the date that I put them in, but if you want to do that you can. Uh, a lot of people date their stuff, but we use our stuff up so we don't... Uh, I don't usually date it. Green peppers or bell peppers are something we go through quite a bit. Using them with tacos and salsas and different uh, varieties of uh, dishes. So it's not something that hangs around a long time. 
to squeeze all the air out of it that you can. Of course, you can use a vacuum sealer if, you, if that's what you have. And this bell pepper will be ready for the freezer. Let's do that one more time. You just cut around the stem end. Cut your pepper in half. Cut out the middle. The seed and the pith, the white is the pith. Now this uh, pepper has a little bit of brown on it. So we're just going to take a minute and just cut that right off. We don't throw the whole pepper away because it's not affecting the whole pepper. Just the spots where you see the brown. And when you get it good and cleaned up, this one's a little bit funny looking because we had to take a, a piece of it off. It'll taste just as good in your recipes. And our goal here is not to waste. Food's expensive. It's one of the largest bills a household has. In an effort to maintain that, we try the most effective way, safest way, delicious and good that we can to take care of our food, to preserve it, and to uh, make the uh, best use out of it. Not to waste is one of the ways you can do that. And after you get it cut up, if you see anything that's not desirable, you know you can just take it out. Doesn't take very long to be conscious of how much of a, a product you're wasting. Just takes a few minutes to make sure that you uh, cutting something up in a way that's not where you don't have a lot of waste. And we'll put that in the freezer bag and we'll continue to cut up the rest of these. Thank you for joining me today. And let me share my uh, budget friendly no waste way of um, cutting up a bell pepper. And like always, until next time.